Here's the Vietnamese iced coffee. It's delicious last time we had it. Mm -hmm. Did you try some? Not yet. Is this straw if you want it? So this morning we're gonna take Poopoo for a walk, uh, but first coffee, yes. And uh, we're gonna check out a new park. We haven't been to the Magnuson Park yet, so we're gonna go check that out um, and see what the views are like there, but just a chill weekend. Nice and sunny day today. Mm -hmm. Does it taste like it did last time? Strong coffee. Mm -hmm. Um, Vietnamese iced coffee is Ooh, like, is yeah, Woo! it's like a espresso with um, condensed milk. So it makes it sweet, but it also makes it really strong. It is, yeah. So it's uh, tolerable. I would explain it. Yeah. Sweet and strong. You do want some coffee? So, nice. Yeah. I love it. You can definitely taste the coffee yeah, for this sure. Is what I like. Perfect. Let's go to the park. How are you gonna get down? Go down really is just another beautiful day. Those look huge. Are they not so big? No, they're regular sized ducks. <laughs> yeah. Seaplane landing. Let's see if a ducks like ice cubes. They're waiting. <laughs> they know it's coming. Oh! They're like looking for it. <laughs> <laughs> Let's play spot the duck. Can you see it? Can you see it now? Looks like you could find a ton of species of birds. So you got like a list of 22 right here. From the, what is this one? Woodpecker? That's a woodpecker. You got a heron here. And then on the hummingbird. Uh, and then on the other side. What is that? 11. Oh. Red tail hawk. Oh, what's 12? That's what we saw at that park one day. The American coot. Hmm. Oh, and then there's eagles. There's the swimmer. Let's see how cold it is. Ooh, pretty cold. That's it, don't drink it. Don't, no, no. No drinking the water. No <laughs> drinking the water. Come on. But no drinking it. You get a belly ache. Oh. No drinking it. <laughs> <laughs> Look at this. Yeah. Is this where airplanes go to die? So let's see what this little plaque says. This is the SSN six five two puffer Nutka. Oh, maybe yeah, they could be uh, ships, like um, whatever ship fins are called. <laughs> the, huh? rudder. the rudder. It's could be the rudder. Tuki, let's go. Come on. We're not done yet. You need to lose a few more pounds, okay, buddy? Look at his tail. Why? <laughs> <laughs> Look at the daddy. So right now, 
we are on our way to Burger Masters. Uh, after that long walk, I was getting a little hungry for a burger, so I found the nearest place to us, and that is where we're heading out. Alrighty, we just pulled up to Burger Master. So that looks like a pretty yummy menu. We got regular burgers. We got, they have a Dungeness and Swiss Melt. That actually looks really good, but. Yeah. So they said when you're ready to order, turn your lights on. And Sarah's gonna do just a normal Burger Master, the quarter pound American cheese, sauce, lettuce, and tomato. And I think we're gonna go with the Dungeness and Swiss Melt just because, you know, we're weird like that. Oh, and uh, maybe shake. the Tom and Jerry shake. Yeah, whatever that is. We'll ask them first. Yeah. <gasps> so they leave a little tray on your window. <laughs> Here's my mushroom. Here's the fin oh, fries. Thank you. Don't want them fin fry. Okay, so I got the Tom and Jerry shake, which is like an eggnog shake. Looks good. Kind of leave that here yeah. for now. I'll move this. Oh, Sarah's big old Coke. And they have a boom boom sauce, whatever that is. That's for our fries. Mm -hmm. Sarah. Oh, that's Hey, hey, he just stole one out of the thing. Here's a little water for Popo. And here's another little biscuit. Aww. Give me another half of poo That's so nice, Poo Poo. And here's some water. Mm, oh, this is gonna be messy. It's okay. Mm. <laughs> Yummy, you wanna try some? Mm hmm. Eggnog. The boom boom, ooh, the boom boom sauce is spicy. Is that? Mm hmm. Ooh, this cools down the spice. That's so good. But so it got boom boom. Ooh, that is so good. This is really good. Alright, now chill out. Okay, so show me your burger. Ooh. Okay. You had so the onions some in there too. Sauce in there. Yeah, I did get onions and pickles, tomato, lettuce, cheeseburger, and a bun. So nice. Mushroom and Swiss. First bites. Cheers. Mm. Mm. Oh, God. It's so clean. Really good. The sauce is good for mm. Mm. After all that water, that feels, it feels pretty good. Uh-huh. Mmm. That tomato is so good. Well, that was a great find. And I think we will definitely be coming back. That was the perfect stop after our long walk. I got some sugar in me from the eggnog shake and the coke. What? You just spit. I no. think you just gleep. No, it, it, it was salt from my fry. Oh, okay. I went like that. We'll see in the video later. <laughs> I'm a knee hooser. Perfect stop. Definitely will be back. Mm -hmm. Next time we come back, though, we'll try the Dungeness and Swiss melt because I didn't actually get that. I just ended up getting the mushroom and Swiss. Yeah. They have a lot of good stuff on their menu, so. Mm -hmm. I mean, everything was delicious, so. Everything was so good, so juicy. The shake was delicious. Atmosphere is pretty good. Atmosphere is great. They got old school music playing. Love that. Servers are nice. Service is pretty quick. They got bathrooms here. So they gave poo, poo a treat. All right, just head home. <laughs> So we're having the DiGiorno's double pepperoni fully stuffed pizza for dinner tonight. Uh, we've actually had this one time before and it was actually pretty good. So not bad for a frozen pizza from the grocery store. So speaking of pizza, we're going to order some pizza four months in advance. So check this out. This is Seattle's odd pizza. It's called Moto Seattle, right? Um, saw a little thing on it. They sell ice cream and like a uh, unique pizza combinations um but here's the issue they sell out 
like months in advance. So this one says uh, April availability, and this one says June availability. Um, I checked out this April availability, and um, it's not allowing you to order. <clears throat> so what we're going to do is we're going to check out and let's see if we can order for June. So look, schedule. Um, let's do, Sarah, does, like, does June 21st on Wednesday sound good? All right, and um, earliest pickup times I have is 8.15. Okay. Yeah, so it sucks, but, you know, they book up. The reviews all look pretty good, so um, let's figure out. So they're they're not huge pizzas, which kind of sucks because they are very expensive. Yeah. Um, I heard... Pizza? No, it's kind of like a personal pizza. I mean, it says you can share between one and two people. Okay. Um, but I heard that the dough is really good. I'm like, how can you go crazy on some flour dough? There's some interesting blends. So here's a pretty basic one I think you might be happy with. Pepperoni, spicy sausage, hot honey, tomato sauce. I want to try something different. You do? Okay. Yeah. Well, what about the cheese? Um, no, I'm joking. Lime sauce. That, that looks pretty good. good too. Okay. So let's try this one for sure. And uh, they don't call you or notify you. They give you one notification when your pizza is ready. And that's it. So you have to remember. And oh, you have to prepay. So it's like, if you forget, you have fuck. Uh, uh clam chowder so this one clams okay no i'm not trying to no that doesn't look so good adobo mm. see he's like i kind of want to try them all but it gets very expensive but leftovers are fine right? leftover pizza is fine that doesn't sound so bad are those tails still on there yeah i was thinking like Kind of as a benchmark, as like a pepperoni yeah. sausage benchmark compared yeah. to all other, you know, Just basic your pizzas. Pizza, yeah. Let's do that. What's the root one? Root is like a, I think, a vegetarian one. Mushrooms, oh, okay. onions, black olives. Do you want to try this one or nah? Oh, we didn't do the crab. Oh, I just didn't click it yet. Oh, oh, let's do the crab. Yeah. Okay. All right. So here we are for seventy dollars. <laughs> We'll have dinner on June 21st. Yeah. And uh, this pizza will probably be like nice leftover. So uh, Mr. Pig, which is going to be pork belly, spicy sausage, yada yada. We got the kist, which is like a nice sausage pepperoni. And we got the crab, which will be spicy sauce. Ooh, Dungeness crab. So uh, today is March 3rd. <laughs> and we're going to order this for June 21st on a wednesday night we're having late night pizza and a lot of it Sounds so good to me. let's lock it in um we gotta pay and um uh, and they're probably gonna earn interest on this money i mean <laughs> it's sitting for so long for them to make pizza so yeah. hopefully it's delicious but we'll let you guys know in june so we'll see you in a few months <laughs> um but back to our own pizza yeah let's see all right, here it is. We're gonna do a cut and let's see if there's cheese coming out. A little bit of cheese. Looks okay. Bye. Mm. Yeah, let's see how Cheese pull? Oh, maybe a little bit. Mm, but the cheese inside the crust is pretty good. Yeah. And. Coconut water, <laughs> not a good pairing. I didn't think so. Um, but that wraps it up for this time. Mm -hmm. And maybe the next time you see us eating pizza will be in June. Or maybe before that. Uh, we're not sponsored by DiGiorno's, but this uh, pepperoni stuff, cheesy crust type thing, freezer aisle at your local Kroger's is a must try. You got to. You know why? Because it's not delivery. It's, it's DiGiorno's. DiGiorno's. <laughs> You want to try some pepperoni? This is Poopoo's first pepperoni. <laughs> <laughs>